All right, Sean, all right, I had no woods hunting, do a little hunting today. And Sean's already picked up something. What you got, Sean? A little buckle. Nice. Got a little deep buckle already. That's only the beginning, anybody. All right. Only the We're getting ready to hit them up right now. Stay tuned. All right, looks like I got a nice round ball in the hole. Down eight inches. Down eight inches. That's sweet. Nice little round ball. Give me a nice 18 on it. On the equinox. All right, it's pretty deep. All right, all right, we're still digging bullets in here. That's a nice three ringer right there. I believe. I had to clean it up a little bit to see it, but I'm um, pretty sure that's what it is. All right, all right, just dug a bullet there, dug a bullet there. Look at this. Well, that's 16. I'm gonna get right on top of it. 17, 20, 16. Jumping just a little bit, but it. I feel like it could be a bullet. Let's see what we got. Let's see if we got a bullet. All right, here we go. Here we go. Okay, we got it opened up there. Let's see what we got. That's what's so exciting. You never know what you're gonna get. Like a box of chocolates. Still hang that up. Try to do it one hand here. Alright, we got a possible black widow spider here. Maybe. I don't know what that is. Alright, and there it is. We got us a bullet in the hole. Another three ringer. Sweet. Pulling the bullets out here left and right today. Alright, let's keep getting up. Alright, Sean's got a nice. Hit right here. Now, my, my machine says it's a bullet. His machine says it's a bullet. Let's see if they're lying to us. Sean, how many bullets we dug today, man? Uh, we dug a few, haven't we? A couple dozen. <laughs> Digging some bullets today. And maybe one more right here, potentially. Mine says bullet. Yep. Sean, you ever get tired of digging bullets, man? Nah, not in this lifetime. I don't either, man. I don't care what. I always love digging the bullets. There it is. It's a bullet. There it is. Sweet. It's a sp Another one. All right, we're going to keep looking. It's a Spencer? Yep. Flat base. Solid wow. base. Nice. All right, this is really cool. I think Sean's got him a bullet in the wood. Awesome, man. Oh, man. I don't know about this. Oh, that's going to be tough there. It could be, it might be in the dirt between them. It, or it could be actually in the ball in the wood itself. I don't know. It's right here. Yeah, it's something right here. That's definitely a bullet there. You got your pinpoint? Yeah. Alright, I think Sean's narrowing it down. Could it be in the wood or is it just stuck in the root ball here? I don't know. But watch it. Right here. A little bit high. I think he got it. Right in there. He should have it getting close now. Alright. Right there. Cut. All right, Sean dug it out. It's stuck in the root ball way up in. I don't know if y'all can see it in front of my finger right there. It's up inside there, though. We'll get it out and show it to you in just a second. All right, Sean's getting that last little pull out of his root is. ball. He got it. There it is. Sweet. It is. Isn't that awesome, man? Right up inside that root ball. I would have never even thought to go to a root ball like that. That's crazy. <laughs> Good right. job, man. Awesome. All right, check this tree out that the beaver cut down. Look at that. He chewed all that off right there and chopped that tree down right there. Look at that. That's pretty cool. He started eating the bark. They eat the bark. That's what they're eating. You see where he was eating the bark down here. He didn't eat up any higher, but he ate the bark down here and you see it. Pretty cool, huh? See all kind of stuff if you get outside. Do a little exploring. All kind of goodies. There. All right. Started off at 23 degrees this morning. He's still getting up. <laughs> Get him, Sean! Get him! <laughs> he's dedicated. Let's see what he gets here in a second. Alright, I hope y'all had a good time on that hunt today. Did you have a good time, Sean? Yes, sir. It was an awesome hunt today. We, we did pretty good, actually. But tell you a quick story. We started out at daybreak in a canoe trying to find some shark teeth. <laughs> that didn't work out too good, did it? Canoe. <laughs> Canoe's on top here, but uh, 
We we abandoned that idea pretty quick uh, after we got a little cold. Yeah, I got but, a little wet. And a little wet. I, we're not going to tell you how it got wet, but... <laughs> <laughs> but I had to paddle him in if that gives you a clue. <laughs> but anyway, we did pretty good. Let's show what we got here. All right. I think I got more roundness than Sean did. Look at the roundness I got, man. I got lots of roundness. Uh, I did dig a few shotgun shells, a couple buttons, and I think about 13 bullets or so right there. Uh, you can tell that one's pulled right there. I believe that's what it's come from. Uh, and this is a three ring. I had to clean them all up, so not sure what they all are yet, but we'll have to clean them up. Oh, what you got over here, Sean? Uh, 15 mini ball. Well, 14 mini ball, a round ball with a spur on it and a neat little cloth pattern. Maybe it smacked somebody. It could have hit somebody and left a little imprint or something. It definitely hit something for sure. It's got some rifling on the side. Here's a cartridge of some sort. Uh, some sort of rim fire, bigger cartridge. It could have been one of these rounds right here. Yeah. Possibly. Definitely. Camp lead and some cut up on bullet. Yeah, that was interesting right there. It looks like they cut right in half. Yeah. I don't is. think it hit. They, that's actually maybe a car bullet or something potentially. This one's cut too. See it sliced yeah. right down the side. They cut that. That definitely cut. How about that? Alright. Not too bad. Let me show the hole. Yeah, man. I can live with that, can't you? Yeah. Every good, time. That's, great, that's, that's a great day right there. Good job, man. Alright. Well, stay tuned. Uh, maybe we'll hit that again one day. We'll do it again. Soon. Alright. King and Queen. Uh, King and Queen. That's coming up. You want to talk about that a little bit? Sure, got uh, got a good bunch of good people gonna meet up at King and Queen March 30th. Uh, look on my, find me on Facebook, Sean Marsh, and there's an open colonial relic hunt for King and Queen County. I'm doing to sponsor my help my friends hunt club out. And 35 bucks all day long, anything from the 1600s cool. to the Civil War. You never know. There you go. So check it out online. I'll try to put a link down in my description too. All right, man. If you like the video, please click like, share it, and comment. All right, thanks for coming along. We'll do it again one day.